Hey guys, so I've been sick for the last over a week and so I thought it would be a good idea to do one of these kind of sick day routines and what I do and have been doing to try to make myself feel better. And uh, yeah, I know a lot of other people have been sick as well, so hopefully some of my tips will help you feel better and um, heal up quick so that you can get back to your normal routine. When I'm sick, I always have this like really gross, I know this is gross, but I have this gross taste in my mouth. So I always just want to brush my teeth and use mouthwash right away in the morning. Um, So as soon as I get up, I'm brushing my teeth and using mouthwash. And I try to do it throughout the day, especially if you have like that cold or flu. Also, I don't know if this is true, but my dentist once told me that 30 minutes after using mouthwash, you're less likely to spread um, anything contagious that you might have to someone else. So yeah, I don't know. Mouthwash definitely helps. And then I'm using my facial steamer with some eucalyptus essential oil. Usually my facial steamer is for my skin, for opening up my pores, and I use it for, um, you know, different skincare routines or if I'm doing a facial or whatever. But today I'm using it to help kind of clear out my chest. And steam is really good for if you have a cough. And right now I have kind of a chest cold, so I have a cough. And so it's really great for kind of clearing it up. And um, yeah, you can do a hot steamy shower. You can do a vaporizer or a humidifier. But this is really great because you're breathing in that steam. And it smells really good and feels really good. And if you're coughing a lot and your cough is dry, this is a really great way to break it up. And then obviously I'm going to wash my face and do my kind of normal, not normal skincare routine, but usually when I'm sick, I feel really, really dry. And so I'm just going to wash my face and I'm going to use um, a facial oil on my skin and eye cream and kind of the usual so that my skin feels hydrated. And obviously when you're sick, you're just kind of chilling or laying low, hopefully. Um... So you're not going to be wearing makeup or anything like that. So I just like to keep my skin really hydrated. I love these wild rose capsules. I get them at Target. I love this brand. I use a few things from this brand. And um, these wild rose capsules smell really good. And rose is just really good for your skin in general. So I've actually been using these a lot over the last week. I took these when I was traveling and they're just really nice. So I'm using that and then I'm going to use my Kate Somerville eye cream that I have right now in my arsenal. And um, yeah. I sometimes bring my eye cream down around my lips because around your lips starts to kind of wrinkle a little bit more as I get close to 30 so I use my eye cream down there and then I'm going to use some Aquaphor lip balm which is really um, hydrating to my lips and again your lips kind of get gross when you're sick and then I'm going to use some eye drops sometimes your eyes feel dry Um, these are our favorite eye drops that's why we get the large and I've actually worked with this company before but we just keep going back and buying the eye drops because they're so good we get them at Target and then I'm using Vapor Rub um yeah, Vapor Rub is the best. Vicks Vapor Rub. When you're sick, you just you just put a little bit on your chest. If you don't want to smell like that, they have these little inhalers you can buy at the drugstore, and you can just open it up and kind of sniff it, and it has um, kind of a eucalyptusy, Vicksy smell. So if you're on the go or you have to work or you're at a desk and you want some sort of relief, that's a really nice option. And then I just try to wash my hands and keep my hands really clean so I don't spread my sickness to my son so far he hasn't gotten it and my husband hasn't either so um yeah I try to wash my hands and especially now I'm gonna go make myself something whenever I'm sick I always crave something with vitamin c um something citrusy so I'm making this vitamin c immune boosting smoothie so I have some pineapple chunks strawberries and sliced peaches and then some orange juice so I'm kind of remaking the jamba juice um They have like a strawberries wild or one of the Jamba Juices. I I just love Jamba Juice, but sometimes it's like really sweet and you can't always get someone to go get it for you. So I, um, I like to have usually sliced fruit, frozen fruit in my freezer. Um, you can add berries for antioxidant, but I just wanted something super citrusy and I always crave that when I'm sick. And I've been using, like I said before in my videos, I use my magic bullet. When you're sick, you don't want to necessarily have to clean out an entire smoothie maker so I, what I love about this is it has the cup attached so I just take it off when it's done and I have a cup right there so it's a really easy cleanup. I don't have a lot to think about when I'm sick and I go and sit out in the sun because I'm getting some vitamin C and vitamin D and vitamin D can actually 
um, help boost your immune system. And if it's a sunny day and I'm sick, I will definitely try to go out and sit out for a little bit and get a little bit of sun. Um, and if it's a cold day, I'll stay inside, but uh, it happened to be a warm day. And then I made myself some easy veggie soup. Again, you're sick. You don't want to have to kind of sit there and slave at the kitchen. So I have this soup that I just got from Sprouts. And I'm going to add, it's a quinoa veggie soup so I'm gonna add some spices because I like my soup really spicy especially when I'm sick and then I'm gonna add some kale you can add broccoli or spinach or whatever you want but I added a lot of kale and it just tasted really fresh and really really good I loved this soup um, perfect for not feeling good and of course hot tea whenever I'm not feeling good I always love to drink hot tea if you have a stomach ache I definitely recommend peppermint stomach ease um, I don't have a stomach issue right now. I have had the stomach flu in the past few months, but this time I have kind of a cough cold. So peppermint's really perfect. I'm just going to add a little bit of honey and I'm going to bring it all over to my bed so I can relax. By my bed, I keep all of my vitamins, my wellness formula, my vitamin C, um, Tylenol, because I had the flu, so I was getting kind of like body aches and headaches. And then I'm gonna use my vaporizer, which I fill up at my bathtub. And then um, I add a little salt, because that really helps get the vapor going. And then I do add eucalyptus as well. So it's not as strong as the facial steamer, but it does help keep the room um, more moisture in the room and uh, it does help with the cough so and I have a pretty bad cough right now which is kind of a bummer so I do love this I just pick you can pick one of these up at Target and I always have it around for if I get sick or my son gets sick and I'm just gonna enjoy my soup and my tea and relax and watch some TV so yeah not feeling good but this is what I do on a sick day or I try to do try to relax um, make yourself a you know vitamin rich smoothie a mineral rich soup and just relax and um, try to get better so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did thumbs up make sure you subscribe to my channel check out my last two videos and my other channel and I'll see you guys very soon bye